this is one of like my uh the video that is like most closest to my heart because it's all about lipsticks and i for one love lipsticks and these are like the lipsticks i've collected over the years probably a few of them have even expired so i need to get rid of them but these are the lipsticks and this is how i store them and uh, let's just go like you know case by case and you know what container by container and i'll tell you exactly how i've organized them so in this container this is like the container that i use the least or is the container in which i put lipstick like these which are like lipsticks i've overused abused and i don't want to use for a few days so uh, in this box i have like a few l18 you know the initial l18 color pops that came up this few are a color burst and a few are color pops so i have like these four shades and this i forgot in the shade number but is one of my top favorite lipstick this is one of my first lipsticks it's like this really pink pretty pink let's see if i can try and get this open in one hand yeah so this is like a really pretty pink shade i think it's shade number 50 okay if you can find the color burst shade number 50 this is one of the few first few lipsticks that i purchased and it is the loveliest shade ever i don't think i'm ever going to get over this lipstick and there's just one other lipstick which i feel similarly about and that is this uh faces lipstick in mulberry slush again one of my like hit top favorite so that is also here because i've just used so much of it i didn't want to use it for a few days at least this is the only lip product that i can carefully say that you know uh i've used i've completed and repurchased this is the only lip product that i can claim that about i just dropped its uh lid let me just pick that up yeah so and then i also have like random lipsticks like this ads one which i've never used and this iba halal one which again i haven't used it's a pretty red color i should actually try and use it more often uh, i'll probably put that in my you know uh, everyday use kind of a stack that i have uh, and then i have my only mac lipstick this is in the shade rebel which is like a really pretty shade uh and then i have some memory lipsticks because this is a gift this is one of like my first gifts from my husband so this is this and i never use it because i don't know it's just got a lot of sentimental value there so very rarely used this is my maybelline lipstick i think i hauled it and this is an itex lipstick itex dazzler yeah so i remember when i got this exactly because I got it at a time when I did not have any makeup. I had been on a tour. I didn't have any makeup and I really wanted a lipstick. I just rushed to the closest store and I found this and I picked it up there. And I have like one random red wet and wild lipstick. That's that for this container. I also have some of my really old lipsticks. It reminds me this color bar is also one of the first few lipsticks that I got. This I think I got in my first salary. This is the stuff I got with my first salary. So that's that. So coming to this one, this one has like lipsticks that I have in like full collections. If I have full collection of some lipstick or more than three or four of each lipstick, which I use regularly, then it will be in this uh, compact holder. So these are the L18 no, Blue Heaven lip colors. These are like lip creams. And I think I got these off of Nykaa, all of them off of Nykaa or i don't know nika amazon somewhere i must have just got them somewhere and then i have the uh, lip cream lip nine to five uh creaseless cream and the whatever other variants that they have i have like five of those shades and these are all basically oranges and reds and mauves no 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 mauves only oranges and reds i i don't know if something wrong with me i got a lot of orange coral when this range came out probably and then i have like the cutest lipsticks of them all this is like by um, i heart makeup i have four of these and i probably will go out and buy all of them these are the four shades i have look at your packaging it's so gorgeous i just bought these for the packaging these are very sheer not all that great but then they feel good on the lip you know they moisturize your lip and the packaging is just to die for then i have the satin lips uh the 
Lakme Enrich Satin Lipsticks. These are like the four shades. Uh, there's a funny story about how I got introduced to these lipsticks. Uh, so, you know, there is this thing wherein the groom brings, the groom's side, the people from the groom's family bring like this entire makeup kit. Or, you know, they just give bangles and stuff like that. Along with that, they also give a comb and makeup related items. And one of these lipsticks was actually in that kit that they gave me on my wedding. So that's how I got introduced to these range, to be honest. So, and then I went ahead and purchased like four more. Uh, here I have all my chubby sticks. I have like one, three from Miss um, Claire, two from Lacme, and this is not. Okay, this I'm actually filming with one hand. I'm sorry. Uh, this one is actually from Makeup Revolution, and I have one from uh, Clinique. I don't know what's the shade. So I have like a couple of them. Oh, I have something really nice too. This one is like the Lacme like Nine to Five. I hauled it recently. This is the cheek and lip stain, weightless mousse for cheeks and lips. This I really love. Um, spoiler alert review coming up soon because I really like those lipsticks because if you're somebody who has you know really dry lips or uh, really pigmented lips these work really well the Lacme mousses they have a really nice consistency and texture uh, these again random lip crayons from elf uh, the super wove collection from uh, I heart makeup I think I have one sugar lipstick in um, what is the shade? Mm, I don't know. Yeah, it's uh, it's a pout it's a pout time. So I have one sugar lipstick in there. So I probably put all these together because they were all in black packaging. Really no logic there. So I had this other. Oh, something really funny about it is that it's in a beaker. So there was some. Um, uh, drama rehearsals going on in my house and those guys left this beaker and I thought it was pretty cute and I could use it for storage and this is another cup that I made by myself a beer mug and I kind of put tape all over it and tried to make it look all funky this has all my lip glosses other than the mm, blue heaven lip glosses these are all the lip glosses I have I have a few from Lacme, from Essence, Color Bar, Streetwear Makeup Revolution, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. This is the only Essence one that I have. Oh, this is the only Essence lip product that I have. This came in some subscription box. So that's that. Then I have some liquid lipsticks here. This is from Kiss Beauty, The Balm, Freedom, Lime Crime. This, I'm not sure, Color of London. Yeah, this is Gala of London and this is something random that I picked out from um, uh, from an Instagram store. So that's it. And these are all my liquid lipsticks. These are the only liquid lipsticks I own. Some Ofra, some Colourpop. That's it. And uh, some of these brands, I know the pain I've gone through to actually, you know, get it. Like I have literally bugged every friend of mine to, you know, like bring me stuff when they go to the US, or bring me stuff when they go to Australia, bring me stuff when they go to the UK. So I have just like bugged everybody's life in order to get these, get a hand on these and some of these here, especially other makeup actually lipsticks. I pretty much buy in India mostly, but other makeup, my God, have I irritated people. So that's it guys. That brings us to the end of the whole lipstick collection video. Uh, I do have a giveaway going on. Uh, the rules for the giveaway will be in the description box below. Do check it out. And until the next one, see ya.